If you have anything to say for yourselves, I suggest you speak up now. I'm sorry, sir. I see no reason for me to have to defend myself. She's a plebeian. In the end, that's the only thing that matters. And you, Damuel? Well, I... We need information to settle this. So speak your mind. Uh. <clears throat> this is a class-based society in action. But I'm sure the head priest will believe me and see that justice is done. Sir Ferdinand? And Sir Karstadt? Priestess? What is it? Were I to tell you what transpired here, would you then guarantee my safety? I'm not sure what you mean. Should I tell you what happened and things become inconvenient for a particular noble, I would hope to avoid getting dragged around by the hair a second time, or having to listen to him threaten to gouge my eyes out again. What is this? Did you do those things to her? A groundless accusation. The stupid commoner stood when she shouldn't have, and into my readied weapon. Damuel, you saw what happened, didn't you? I want to hear the truth. I don't think he saw it, did you, Damuel? I'm a lesser noble. And Shikikoza told me I needed to remember my place. I couldn't stop him, and he hurt the priestess. With all of my heart, I'm sorry. <gasps> That's right. You must never forget who ranks above you. <sighs> By the way, Shikikoza. Could you remind me who holds the highest rank of all the knights gathered here? That would be you, Sir Ferdinand. Indeed. And I remember giving you a specific order. Make sure the priestess receives nary a scratch. What part of that did you fail to understand? Uh, if you're so obsessed with our ranks, it should have been obvious what course of action you needed to uphold. You've shamed yourself. You should know your place, you cad! But sir, she's just a peasant. That girl you hurt is no mere peasant and worth more than a simpleton like you. Mine is an apprentice priestess. With the Lord's approval, she was granted blue robes due to her abundance of mana. Know that voicing any complaints with that choice would be dissent against the Lord himself, breaking your oath as a knight. Not only did you two disobey orders, but you abandoned your duties by hurting the one placed in your charge and brought disgrace to the knight order. It is foolish to think you'll get off lightly. In due time, the Lord will sentence you accordingly. And Karstadt, you chose incompetent men to serve as her bodyguards, and have failed to properly discipline these two recruits. You're responsible as commander of the Knight Order. You'll be punished in due time, too. I understand, sir. This mess has exposed my lack of leadership and the need for more training in the Knight Order. Sir Ferdinand, I apologize for causing you the trouble of having to step in. On my honor, I will make up for this. Hurry. We need you to finish the ritual while the potion is still effective. All right. Let's go. Oh.